For creating the FPGA bitstream for the PL and Xilinx's first stage bootloader, we need to download and install some software tools called Vivado and Vitus. Vivado helps you create the bitstream and Vitus helps you create the first stage bootloader or any other applications you'd like to run on the CPU on the PS side, whether that be bare metal or higher level application. Luckily, both of those software tools are free and can be installed by one software package on Xilinx's website. So let's do that now. The first thing you'll want to do is go to the Xilinx download page for Vivado, which I'll put a link in the description. If you scroll down a little, you'll see a couple of links for how you want to download and install the Xilinx tools. Since I'm on Linux, I'll choose the Linux self-extracting web installer. Xilinx will ask you for a login before you can download anything, so make sure that you create an account with them first with the Create Account button below. I already created an account, so I'm just going to log in. Once all the information is filled out on this page, you can scroll down and click the Download button. Once the download is complete, navigate to the download directory and make the binary file that you just downloaded executable with the chmod plus x command. Now you can execute the binary file. After selecting next, you'll need to put in your Xilinx login again, then select next. Then you can just accept the defaults for both of these pages. Make sure to read the license agreements and terms of conditions before proceeding. After pressing the I agree checkbox for all of them, click next. The tools Xilinx path will be the location that the installer will download all the Xilinx tools to. You can change this if you'd like, but I'll be using the default. As you can see here, the disk space required for this install will be about 143 gigabytes. Press next, then press yes, and select install. This whole install took me about one hour and 15 minutes.